I'm Giovanna. What's love sparkling it, in it. your world today, ladies? Mm, sparkle? Mm. sparkle, sparkle. Are we going to take a moment to get into the yes. present? Oh, that's great. Oh, Do that. Yeah. Let's take a moment to take a deep breath in. Slide down into our, from our head to our heart on whatever beautiful ride you want to take down to get down there. And then just rest. I you're mentioning something mm-hmm. about the love bombing. You want to share that? Okay. Yeah. I, well, I came up with a new way to share love last night because, you know, on Friday nights, there's this on in big influx of traffic from the Bay area, people that they work all week and they wish they could live here, but they race up here as soon as they can get here. And I was just like each set of headlights that came up. I'm like, Oh, I know. I love them. I know they're such great people. I just, I just Aww. felt love. And so I started having this like backwards love bazooka, where I would just like and shoot a bomb of love on them, love bomb them. Oh, and it just felt so good because all our roads are like little two lane. So you can do it. You know, it's not like being on a freeway or something. And that, uh, that, it just was so fun. That reminds me of when I used to do that all the time too. And I never thought it was really a thing until I came across this community in Sarah's with that, how much, how much it really works, right? Just seeing others and their love and their perfection and send them love and, and your self love at the same time, right? Yeah. Bask in that love. Yeah. 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 And you feel, how does it make you feel? Yeah. When yes. You do that. Exactly. Because each little psh is just like this, oh, this explosion, you know, of love. You know? Yeah. And, and it even just gets when bigger I'm and off, bigger. Yeah. Even when I'm turning off the road to go down into my neighborhood, I'm like, to the last two little cars, you know, they were up there, you know, catch those two. <laughs> oh, oh, that's so wonderful. Yeah. You know, um, Lester Levinson, who um, created the Sedona method, he's, oh, he's, yes, he's left his body, but he, so he, in his 40s, woke himself up and he was told to go home from the hospital and not like just kind of like live on his own don't create too much excitement because you're gonna die right because he had like heart issues and all this stuff so he went home and then after a day or two he's like what kind of life is this i gotta figure out where did i go wrong like he was like where did i go wrong or something along those lines right we always start Mm -hmm. with that and then he just started reliving everything and he realized that it wasn't who loved him that made him feel so good. It was when he was extending the love he was. Mm. That's what, and so that started his whole awakening journey. And he woke himself up in like 40 days or 60 days, some yeah. incredible, yeah. incredible thing. Yeah. And, ju- and then just shared and extended that love and knowing for and, the rest of his life. And, and didn't he go to like Sedona? Sedona? Method. Didn't and, he like intend to go to Sedona and like he didn't even. Yeah, have a plane he lived ticket. in New York at the time and he didn't even have a plane ticket and he just went to the airport and like somehow it was gifted to him along the way and bought this tract of land and, you know, like built a house. Oh, cool. I haven't family. heard those stories. Oh, yeah. Fun. Yeah. I've there heard other woman, magical there, stories of him. Yeah. He had all these, this, I think 160 acres and there was a woman that lived in a little cabin there and he wanted to live in the cabin, but she wanted to move into town. So he himself built her at like age 70, built her by himself a little house in town where she could live in exchange for her giving him that house. So he could wow. be out there and, you know, he had all, I wow. think he had like a retreats. I think, that, I think that Florence Scoville Shin and 
like uh, oh what's the artist uh, Martha Gr not Martha Graham um, the painter out there um, the paints the cow skulls and the, the flowers um, oh she's she's huge I got my anyway uh, but she she's a big influence in the Sedona area and she, she was part of his thing too oh cool with well, Sedona is just spectacular yeah. but yeah well that's so fun yeah there's a lot of he well because we are magic and once yeah. you realize who you are that just starts to grow bigger and bigger yes. because you're the creator of your reality and um yeah but it was the extension of love was the key for him becoming aware of who he was it's like oh my gosh i'm the love I'm the love mm -hmm. in my life. So how much can I extend? And look at you. Look at you gals with your fairy <laughs> dust everywhere. <laughs> well, how do you think we should spread this? How do you think we should, uh, you know, Our like fairy dust in the magic market? <laughs> I, I'm curious. Oh, yeah. So we were talking about um, this sparkle show. And, and, you know, we just we're doing it. I'm doing it. I'm not going to speak for both of you. I'm doing it just because it delights me. I love spending time with you. It expands me when I am with you. Yeah. And I love our conversations because it just, everything starts clicking, right? Yeah. And it just lights me up. It lights me up. And so, love, love yeah. Frequency. And then, the love frequency. Yeah, it's the frequency right? of love. Like I'm just riding it. And I'm like, woohoo, yeah. you know? <laughs> Like one of those slides, right? You're on the potato sack and you're going down. And <laughs> yes. Of course, but we're, it seems like we're going up somehow. The slide is going up. Yeah, we're sliding up. <laughs> <laughs> we're defying gravity and we're sliding up. Um, so, yeah. So, like, and we so know, I think we've said before, like, this is one and done. We don't edit these because we stay in our joy and it just flows through. And then with the marketing piece, so Gwendolyn has been posting the YouTubes and um, wanted to, started talking about the social media um, paradigm, perception, whatever you want to, <laughs> the groove that everybody's in mm. about how do we get the word out? Yeah. And, and I love Jeannie. Like, because I, I misspoke. I'm like, oh, well, these platforms, you know, we must go and fit into TikTok's box because these platforms won't let us have, you know, have a voice anymore because they're limiting and they're asking it to be an advertisement. And, and Jeannie's like, ah, 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 ah. And she stopped me and Not it felt my so world. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not in my world. Not in my world. My world. This is super fun. And the the creative director the the um the one and only <laughs> the one source of creation that, what, that what is, did you say before because your, your voice kind of crackled in that last statement the, the oh the the one source of creation right mm. the all the the um however you want to name that that the one source that we all are different as different perceptions yeah. different aspects different facets different perceptions however you want to um the sparkly has, it's particles all, of creation yeah sparkling par right. particles of creation so we sparkles are, are that get to just, decide yeah we're gonna allow how the that's gonna flow through us yeah. to go and spark where they need to go right like the yeah and yeah that's and like how like everything else we just tune in yes and if something seems choiceless like this channel this channel yes. was completely choiceless to start. Yeah. That's where we know is where we put our energy yes. or we yes. post or we. And anything that feels like happens. anything that feels like work. Ah, out. Yeah. You or know, anything that feels like a limitation, like somebody's idea of, okay, you have to post this mm -hmm. many times a week on wherever Instagram or mm -hmm. TikTok or mm -hmm. whatever it has. And it has to be this format. Uh -uh. Yeah. Whatever feels good and you're inspired to do, and you'll know you're inspired to do it because it's literally effortless. It's following your just, joy. Following you your guys, joy passion, this, right? this morning I woke up early um, and I was like so excited. And then when it was time to, you know, normally when I have to be somewhere, I'm like, you know, the, this other bad story happened. 
But today I was just like putting on my clothes and I was feeling so good. And I'm like, oh my God, this is my job. <laughs> and it just feels so wonderful. There's no, there's no thought of not wanting to be here and be with you. Yeah. I don't yeah. even know what that word yeah. means, job. I just, it just sounds it fun, It seems right? so foreign now. It's like just yeah, playtime. Yeah, it does. Like, oh, playtime. Gosh, yeah. I have like when you were a kid, playtime, right? <laughs> Who am I going to play with today? Who am I going to play with today? Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You be, the, you be the car and I'll be the gas station attendant. Yeah. You know, like whatever. <laughs> yeah, and did you pre-plan it? Did you say, okay, um, Hey Frankie, on uh, Saturday I'm gonna show up and we're gonna play gas station attendant, and you're gonna be, you know, whatever. No, it was always like we're gonna get together and play, and then all of a sudden it's like, oh my gosh, let's play, you know, gas station. It would just yeah. arise, <laughs> just like we're doing with this show, yeah, and just like we've done, and it's like, oh my gosh, that would be so fun to do, and then boom, all of a sudden you're posting it on YouTube, uh -huh. and then boom. Who know? I I just got the Instagram account, but I haven't been, um, you know, it hasn't come through. Of okay, boom, here here's posted on Instagram or whatever. We don't know, but we're we're not the we're not the orchestrator. Yeah, we right. are the we are the sparks at the end yeah. of the magic wand, which is, the magic yes. wand, right? That's the. We, it's we, like the council we're says that we're being we're being opening and allowing, right? We're being opening and allowing yeah. source yes. to run the flu through us right mm -hmm. and now yes so that's exactly what the we're doing the pathway right? of least resistance and yeah. we're making it as wide and easy yeah yeah your mic's now out out a little bit genie today creation to flow through us a little bit oh. oh darn okay maybe it's my little earbuds yeah but yeah it's just allowing that perfect orchestration to to flow through without resisting it going, Oh, I have to do this. I have to create this. Oh my gosh. You know, yeah. deadline, lack, blah, whatever it is. It's just like, Nope, just stay in that innocent excitement and go, Oh my gosh, you know, what would be really fun, you know? And then, yeah, that's the magic. It's so, joyful. That creates it's so the magic. easy. It's so yes. easy, right? It's so easy and joyful and playful. It's not like I don't, stress. What is that word? You know, anxiety. What is that word? You know, like, we're just mm -hmm. taking those words just out of it, right? Just, yes. just dimension, just creation, just are naturally who we are, right? And it just feels yeah. so incredibly good. It feels so, it's like our cells have been like, had their little yeah. mouths open for it for so long. Liberated. And it just get to like, ah, oh, yeah. Finally. And it's here. just, yeah. And it's just that awareness. I want to go back to that when you said I was, you said, oh, I, I, this is how it works and all that stuff. And I said, no, 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 not in my right. world. That's not yeah. how it works. We're going right. to allow the flow. This is how every aspect of your world opens up wider and wider to the magic you are. Is you catch yourself in those moments of limitation mm -hmm. and you're like, oh, my God. Like the only, everybody has said this, Bashar, Tom Kieran, the council, every, you exist and everything else is a belief. You exist. You can't not exist. There's no non-existence is a whole not, like you can't not exist. You exist. And then you come into this experience and you put your limitations, you know, whatever they be, even if it's the biggest, biggest expansive thing, it still is limiting all of creation, right? But this is the experience but you get to decide how unlimited that experience is going to be. And the key to doing it is along with being the extension of love that we mentioned is to catch yourself when you are putting some mm -hmm. old belief mm -hmm. that no longer works for you. And, and you're like, Oh yeah, I'm the yeah. creator. It can be whatever I want it to yeah. be. And see that response too, Jeannie. And it's it, not it, like judging yourself for anything ever. Yeah. It's like, oh, silly me. Go on. Always Don't about loving me. yourself. Yes. Well, we got to You should congratulate like, yourself when you do catch yourself. You're like, oh my gosh, I just got myself in the organization. <laughs> Woohoo! Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh.
Sorry, guys. I click on something. Time to dance. Oh, maybe Giovanna had some. She had one last thing to add. Maybe. <laughs> maybe. Okay. Did no, you have one last thing? Oh no, it's all perfect. I just was saying. Oh, sure. okay. Time just flies with us when we're chatting like this. You know, it just is like I can't believe it's already been twenty minutes, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Love you guys. Yeah, it's fun. Oh my gosh! Thank Love you for you. all you've Love done for me today. Mwah. <laughs> all of our sparkles out there in the YouTube and every other yes in land the land of. Mm -hmm. and in, in the ethers of everything and in the hearts yeah you shine so bright you sparkle you Sparkles to come out of my. <laughs> <laughs>